What is up my beautiful mangas? My name is the Iron Mango and today I am bringing you guys a very very special how to install Pixelmon 4.0.5 tutorial video. A lot of you guys have been asking me questions on how you guys can play your very own version of Pixelmon and now the new update has finally come out so I decided why not let's tell you guys how you can install Pixelmon 4.0.5 so that you guys can finally play on my server. A lot of you guys have been asking me questions on how you guys can play on my server because we do have a Pixelmon 1.8 server. Me and Juice said it's one of the only Pixelmon 1.8 servers out there. It's called the Poco Legends SMP Season 2. I'll link down below in the description how you guys can join that server. So definitely be sure to check that out if you guys want to play some Pixelmon on a public server with a lot of my fans and Juice Ed's fans and some other beautiful mangoes. And if you guys are new to the Mango Nation, definitely be sure to hit that little button that says subscribe. So I do post two to three new videos every single day. Day, including a lot of brand new Pixelmon videos as well. And definitely be sure to slap that like and like button if this video is helpful in any way, shape, or form. Let's try to go for 200 likes on today's video. That would make my heart go pitter patter. But essentially, you're going to head over to pixelmonmod.com and then you're going to go over to the downloads link over here, the downloads page over there. I'll have a link down below in the description if you guys are too lazy to click all this stuff. You can just click that link and then you don't have to type in anything. Then you're going to see Pixelmon 4.0.5 1.8 recommended. It just came out, literally just came out a couple of minutes ago, as you can see right here. It is 12:53 a.m. on Tuesday, June the 9th, 2000. 2015. It literally just came out on June the 9th, 2015. But you're going to go over here. You're going to see where it says download. You're going to download the first link over there. You're going to have to wait six seconds for the thing to download. Don't click any of these other uh, links because it might give you a virus and other cool stuff like that. But then you're going to skip the ad over there and then it's going to bring you to a page that says, I live a download. Do not click that because that might give you a virus as well. Then you're going to have to wait seven seconds or eight seconds on this other page, which is called pixelmongs.com slash core slash 4.0.5. As you can see right here, this mousecraft video. Then you're going to click download pixelmon 4.0.5. You're going to keep the file it will not harm your computer dudes do not worry it will not harm your computer then you're going to go over to the minecraft forge it's going to be files.minecraftforge.net i'll link down below in the description of this as well so you guys don't even have to click in anything i'm doing all the work for you dudes so you guys are going to have an awesome time installing and playing pixelmon 1.8 or 4.0.5 the new update that literally just came out i do not like using the, the latest version of forge it's not really good to use the latest version of forge so we're going to use the recommended version of forge we're going to go over here to the installer you're going to click the installer for the recommended version of forge you're going to have to wait six seconds seconds for the uh, update to be able to like let you install so don't click any of these other ads because that might get you a virus do not do that dudes then you're just going to click skip and then it should download forge for you right there as you can see right there it's 3.2 megabytes and then we're going to open up the forge file it's a jar file you might need winrar to actually open this up i'm not sure so if you guys don't know how to get winrar definitely be sure to look up a video on how to install winrar or if you guys want me to make another video on how to install winrar definitely let me know down below in the comments section and we can definitely do it as well but essentially you're going to want to install the client version of forge you're not going to install the server version you're going to install the client version of forge you're going to say okay it's going to go to your roaming minecraft file over there so you're going to say okay it's going to install forge for you and as you can see right here my pixelmon 1.8 has installed as well so essentially we're going to go over to our start menu we're going to type in percent app data percent and then it should bring you to the roaming folder you're going to click on the roaming folder you're going to click on your dot minecraft folder you're going to go inside there should be no mods folder if you haven't played any mods before if you have played mods before then you probably do have a mods folder i deleted my mods folder so i can make this video a little bit more helpful for you guys who have never installed mods before in minecraft but if you do have a mods folder just make sure to delete all the other mods that are in your mods folder then you're going to go over here you're going to right click your uh, mods folder you're going to say new folder you're going to make a new folder and then you're going to title it mods just mods nothing else no capitals just mods you're going to open that up essentially actually no you have to open up your uh, pixelmon thing over there so you're going to show that in your folder it should go to your downloads the pixelmon 1.8 4.0.5 universal then you're going to go into your mods folder over here as well you're going to drag the pixelmon 1.8 4.0.5 universal dot jar into your mods folder and now you've officially got pixelmon dudes i'm going to show you guys how to install custom npcs as well before i actually load up my minecraft and show you guys that this does work and then we'll go hop on the poke legends smp server so that I can show you guys around on the server if you guys do enjoy the server. Definitely be sure to check it out as well. But we're going to go over to www.codevelopment.nl slash Minecraft slash custom NPC slash downloads. I'll link down below in the description for that one. That might be one might be a, a little bit difficult to type. So I'll have a link down below in the description for that one as well. And then you're going to see over here it says 1.8.0 beta. You're going to download the 1.8.0 beta version. To be able to join my server, the Poke Legends SMP Season 2, you're going to need custom NPCs 1.8 because we do have custom NPCs for the in-game shops and a lot of other cool stuff on the server so hope you guys are excited about that but we're gonna go over here where it says download you're gonna click the download thing over there this is a revolutionary oh no dudes making on the <laughs> it's making noise on facebook it's Twitter, making noise <laughs> oh my god it's annoying dudes it's making noise okay we're gonna skip it we're gonna skip it money 
we're gonna skip it and then uh, we can close that so century let's get install custom npcs i do apologize that it made a little bit of noise right there but now we have custom npcs in our jar folder so we're gonna show it in the folder in our downloads folder i meant instead of jar folder and then we're gonna go back to our mods folder and we're gonna drag custom npcs 1.8.0 beta into the mods folder and then we should be good to go to be honest so now we're gonna open up minecraft as you can see right here i'm gonna open up minecraft i have minecraft on my second monitor that's why you couldn't see it right there but we are opening up the minecraft launcher just very the very basic minecraft launcher that's all that you guys have to open up so you're gonna open up the minecraft launcher we're gonna create a new profile we're gonna title it pixelmon 4.0.5 update you don't have to title it that but just title whatever you guys want make sure it's something that you guys can remember it doesn't really matter what the name is i like playing with resolution 1280 by 720p then you're going to make sure that you use the version uh forge one point or release 1.8 forge 11.14.1.1334 1. 1. 1. 1. 1. that's the newest version of forge that we just got or at least like the recommended version of forge that we got i believe that the 14.0.4 or the 1404 version does work as well but let's use the 1334 version for now we're going to save our profile we're going to go down i clicked the wrong thing by accident i clicked the launcher by accident we're going to go down here though and then we're going to click on the pixel 4.0.5 update we're going to make sure we use that profile we're going to play our game we're going to launch up minecraft it takes around 12 to 14 seconds i believe to launch minecraft on my computer because i don't have the most op computer in the world it's a little bit of a it's a little bit of an old-fashioned computer not gonna lie dudes but it gets the job done for minecraft it definitely gets the job done for minecraft so here we are launching up minecraft 1.8 and then essentially once we launch this minecraft 1.8 we're going to be able to hop on pixel on 4.0 0.5 so I hope that you guys are very very excited about that hopefully this video was very helpful for you guys if it was definitely be sure to slap that like and a like button let's try to go for 200 likes on today's video as I was saying earlier it does take quite a while to load up Minecraft not gonna lie dudes it's uh loading up the mind the Mojang screen right now but we should be able to enter a single player world and then you guys are gonna be able to enter the Poke Legends SMP season two as well if you guys want to play on my public Poke Legends or Pixel on 4.0.5 server you guys are gonna need the custom NPC mods as well so be sure to install that I did tell you guys how to install the custom NPC mod as well for 1.8 so be sure to have that installed in your mods folder you guys can also add optifine shaders anything cool like that like the Zerdos mini map I like using the Zerdos mini map uh for my mini map in Pixelmon I like using the mini map in the 1.8 Pixelmon but I'm so excited for this brand new update if you guys want to see me do a Pixelmon 4.0.5 mod showcase definitely let me know down below in the comments section and we can definitely make it happen I can show off all the new things that were added in Pixelmon 4.0.5 but essentially we're going to go over to a single player game we're going to create a new world we're just going to call it new world we're going to be in game mode survival and I will show you guys that I can finally play Pixel Mod 4.0.5, the brand new update that literally just came out, and I'm so excited for all the new things that have been added in this update. There literally are a lot of cool new Pokemon, a lot of cool new bugs and tweaks and fixes and other items and abilities that were added to the game. Let's go into full screen mode so you guys can actually see the entire screen. Uh, we're not actually in full screen mode. We're still doing our uh, what desktop capture. We're not really doing the game capture right now, but it should be doing fine for today's video. For the purpose of today's video, it is just a how to install video. It's not really like a let's play, even though I do post two to three new videos every single day. I post like a Pixelmon video, and then like a factions video or a parkour video or uh, some other cool thing like, like sky viable arc survival evolved i post a lot of awesome videos on my channel so hope that you guys go check them out and are excited about that but my favorite starter ever was bulbasaur so let's pick bulbasaur and let's head into the game and as you can see right here we are playing on pixelmon 4.0.5 i am getting pretty laggy frames right now and it doesn't look that beautiful because i'm not using optifine in this client of minecraft i'm still getting around 48 frames actually that's not too bad dudes that's not too bad uh, but let's look around let's see uh, actually you know what dudes we're gonna poke a spawn we're gonna oh, actually I don't think I have access to focus on right now because I'm not opt but I think that's gonna be all for today's video hopefully you guys did enjoy today's video hopefully it was very very helpful in telling you guys how you can install pixel on 4.0.5 hopefully you guys go hop on my server poke legends SMP season 2 it'd be awesome to see a lot of new faces on the server it is a very very fun server with a lot of beautiful mangoes so hopefully you guys go check it out if you haven't already hit that little button that says subscribe if you haven't already as well as I do post two to three new videos every single day as I was saying earlier but hopefully you guys did enjoy today's video hopefully it was very helpful and I hope that you guys have a nice, safe, wonderful day.